Hey guys, make sure you stand till the end. If you make one common mistake, you may end up spending hundreds, even thousands of dollars on parts and diagnostics you don't need. Make sure you stand till the end. We will explain what we are talking about. Hey guys, welcome back to World Mechanics. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be a super helpful video to any of you guys having a Chevy Tahoe or Chevy Suburban. That generation here from year 2006 to year 2014. If you guys have one of those, if you need to find where the fuel pump relay is located, which relay you need to check, where you can buy cheap parts, tools, fuses, relays at a good price, quick shipping. That way you do not waste money and time. Why it's important guys to always test fuses and relays. All that guys will be covered absolutely free for your convenience make sure you stand till the end. So before we start let us tell you a little bit about us guys. If you have a Chevy Tahoe or a Suburban practically they are built on the same platform. We'll be making a video about every single fuse relay in that SUV. Why? Because let's say you're down the road you need to find where the fuse for fuel injectors, fuel pump, ignition coils is located that way you can fix your SUV and be back on the road we will have that information you'll just spend a minute or two watching the video fix it and it will take care of that problem now every single car we get here at the garage we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos we take them guys completely apart we show you how to do engines transmissions mechanical body work and we have more than 12,000 free repairs on our youtube channels that can save you thousands of dollars in future repairs in addition guys if you need to buy any parts tools fuses relays at a really good price quick shipping that way you do not waste your money and time we will put the links in the description of the video below for your convenience so let's start on it now for the fuel pump we need to check up to three relays you may have a dedicated relay just special for the pump but it may be integrated in two more relays that you need to check now we'll demonstrate on that Chevy Tahoe here Chevy Suburban is just the same vehicle just longer guys practically they're built on the same platform you have three different fuse boxes in that SUV. The first, okay, and practically the only one that we need is under the hood. Open the hood. If you face the engine on the right side here, you have a fuse box under this cover. Open it and you'll find the main engine fuse box with a layout that will look exactly or really close to this one here. Before we guys continue, let's explain quickly why it's always a good idea to test fuses and realize. So now why it's super important guys to test fuses and relays because often you may think you have a good fuse right but uh, it could be guys a bad fuse sometimes it's really hard to tell it's hard to see you have different kinds of fuses and each one of those guys it, let's say you think it's a good fuse but it's actually bad you may end up spending time money on parts and uh, repairs that you don't need so always test fuses it takes only uh, a few seconds we'll put a link to a special video that will teach you how to test fuses and how how to test relays as well relays are easy to test uh, that way you can eliminate that possibility for something uh, that uh, that's not necessary guys so check out the links will be in the description of the video below so here now guys for the fuel pump okay if you need to find fuel pump fuses we have the video on the channel check it out oh and by the way if you need to buy any fuses relays parts tools fuel pumps for chevy uh, Tahoe Suburban or any car at a really good price quick shipping we'll put the link in the description of the video below that way you do not waste money and time here guys the first relay okay that you need to check you may or may not have this one will be the, the one right there some models will some will not other relays that you need to check is this one here and the run crank relay okay right there those are the main ones that you need to check hopefully the video will be helpful thank you for watching see you next time